This is Scriptly Live, where we tell you what's hot on the big screen and what's trending on your TV and more. Bring me the lamb. I think it looks great, and honestly, I mean, I think they could have cast someone a little bit older and crankier for Jafar, but it's fine. I mean, we'll suffice, it's hot, but whatever. I think you're being a bit hard on Guy. Oh, hey, hey, we're on, uh, we're on a first name basis with Guy. Do you think this film stayed true to the original 1991 cartoon? In the main, yes, I'd have to say it does. Um, once you get past the, the live action part, you can slip right back into what was. Right. Uh, and aside from the, the two new songs, mm -hmm. yeah. and maybe one or two characters that I don't remember from the first one, uh, yeah, I'd say it stuck pretty close to the original. Like <laughs> that film. might be the hashtag of the show. I love film, that but I don't like, you know, I like cerebral films, people, you know, the average rom-com. Um, <laughs> this whole Spider-Man and the Spider-Verse was just weird to me. Hey guys, Kyoto here, and welcome to another episode of Black Sploit, a forum where we celebrate everything in the black arts. Now today we are bringing you the 1972 black exploitation classic, Superfly. I think The Post will win Best Picture, and three reasons why: Kate, Tom Hanks, Meryl Streep, and Steven Spielberg. Yep, that's all you need to win, aside from a compelling storyline and Spielberg's genius, of course. And all three are Oscar winners, by the way, mm -hmm. all right? This film stands a great chance among this year's very tough nominees. Let's hop right into yeah. it. Uh, tell us a little bit about you uh, as an artist, as a filmmaker, uh, and give us some background on myth. Hey guys, it's Kate Howard here for another episode of Chick Flick. Tonight, we're gonna be talking about Britney Runs a Marathon. You did a great job at including a beginning, a middle, and an end, but also leaving it open for possibly more exactly. story and more exposition. So it's big to both of them because yeah. they need to uh, imagine what it's like to be uh, outside since they're not. Yeah. So they need to create a world, and that world was in that room and it was bigger than uh, big, bigger than it really was right. for that simple reason. Just and I didn't even think of it like that. <laughs> Speaking about technology, right? Mm -hmm. um, made the theme of your show. Sure. Uh, one of the classes that still stands out to me because it's probably one of my favorite movies of all time this is, true. Uh, is Jurassic Park. Also follow us on yep. Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and stay tuned for new episodes of Blacksploit and Chick Flick coming soon. Take care, guys. Later, guys. <laughs> <laughs>